Well, isn't that kind of a leap? Because for so many years, uh, artificial intelligence has overpromised, and even now that it's been successful, we are are, are seeing things. There's improvement in visions and things like that. But what makes you think that it can take on the big problems? Yeah, it's a, it's a really good question. I mean, in many ways, the field of the last 30 years has been dominated by great deal of over overhype um, with periodic winters where we've seen massively reduced investment um, in, in the field, largely because it's failed to deliver. I think this time round, a number of things are very different. We have incredible data sets. Um, we have the, the compute capacity to really take advantage of the data that is available. And we've made incredible progress with the algorithms um, that really those three things together have allowed us to make very significant progress. And I guess we were sort of lucky enough in some respects that we made the right call on deep learning before anybody else in the field thought that it was possible to make progress with these kinds of algorithms, and, you know, partly why we're called DeepMind. Um, and very quickly, we demonstrated that these could be used to solve really quite general problems. And, and that's the value of deep learning particularly, um, is that they can solve a wide range of tasks using um, you know, largely the same kind of algorithmic architecture.